Oh, 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 oh. There's a nice fish. Wow. I don't see a bed or anything over here, though. That's why I didn't see the fish until I got right up on top of it. Oh, oh, get excited. Come on, pick it up. The tail's moving a whole lot. Oop. It's all over it. Come on, fish. Oop. Got him. Stuck in final. No. Golly. No way. Well, I just made a mistake that I've actually yet to make this whole time that I've been filming for my YouTube channel. I forgot to press record when I first got out of my car. I thought I was recording the whole time. I even made a little intro for where I was at and everything. I thought I was recording the whole time. And I walked up and saw a bedding fish over here. And I didn't even see him really that well. But I saw him down here. And I can't even... Oh, there he is right there. There he is again. Golly. I heard he got him to bite once. Now I'm trying to get him to bite again. Like I said, I didn't get any of that stuff on film though. Because I actually forgot to press record when I first got out of my car. That's ridiculous. God, all this wind is not helping. This overcast. Throwing a natural color crawdad on this fish, so you can't see my bait at all when, unless it's real sunny. Well, don't think this fish is real big. And he's already eaten this crawdad once, so Let's see if he'll maybe eat this. Well, I can say trick worm, but hold on. God, I had this old, this old rage menace that I found in my car the other day. God, it's so torn up though. It's gonna be very difficult to even get to stay on a hook. But I think it'll work. He'll bite it. Oh, beat up bait. Let's see if I can get this fish to bite. Oh yeah. When it's real sunny like this, I can see him right up against the bank right now. He's right there. Oh yeah, whip around on the bait. Ah, so he's kind of running off right now. Like he's scared of it, I guess, from getting stuck once already. Come on, man. Just want to land you and show you to the camera. Try and wait till I see the fish again so I can work it right up next to him. Come on, clouds. Give me a little break. Golly. All right, as I say that, the wind starts blowing even harder. I think I see the fish in there though. Oh, come on, go away, ducks. Don't scare my fish away. Uh, no, I'm working on a little uh, little male right here on a bed right now. Yeah, it's called a uh, Relentless Pursuit of Bass. Oh, I'm, I'm, no. Okay, cool. Okay, sweet. Yes, sir. You catch him out here today or what? Yeah, just one. Yep. Yeah, they're I, they're really starting to spawn pretty much everywhere right now, but yeah, that little guy's right there behind it. Oh yeah, there he is. Oh, 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 oh! Sorry about that. <laughs> Didn't mean to hit you like that. Oh, you're good. Golly. <laughs> he ate my bait. And I missed him. Dang it. <laughs> Sorry about that, man. That was crazy. Came like a bullet. Jeez. Yes, sir, you too. God dang, that was crazy. I just drilled that dude in the chest with my weight. 
Holy cow. <laughs> that was, uh, that was wild. I hope he doesn't think that I did it on purpose. I just realized somebody, somebody might think I did it on purpose to scare him away or something, but that was not <laughs> intentional whatsoever. That was wild. This fish, <laughs> but <laughs> I just realized something else too. That kind of stinks because that fish just took my last, uh, my last white rage menace that I had. So now I'm going to try to flip this, this little trick worm on him. He's getting scared a little bit by these ducks, I think. He's swimming around a lot right now. You can see him way up shallow. Yeah, those ducks are scaring him right now. Here he comes back, right back to the bed. Let's see if I can get him eat this little bait now. Come on, dude. Oh yeah, Ooh, got him. Stuck him, perfect. First pitch, nice. All right. All right. First pitch with a little trick worm deal and he ate it messed up his jaw a little bit there it seems like sorry buddy anyway wow that is a nice thick freaking solid male right there real healthy fish thank you for playing buddy that was fun well he was ticked off after i missed him that time he was not shy at all that fish was ready to go after that one anyway like i was trying to say earlier when I first walked up, and I apparently wasn't recording, I'm out here this afternoon at Elmendorf Lake, it's about 3 o'clock now, it was about 2.40 when I got here I guess, so it's probably closer to about 3 o'clock now, and I really didn't plan on even fishing today, because I was giving myself a little break, as you can probably tell, my allergies are acting up and they've been acting up real bad the last few days. So I decided to give myself a little break yesterday and then I was going to today, but this weather just got so nice and warm today that I had to come out and check on this spot. I haven't been here in a few weeks. I caught them decent the first time I came here. I actually caught a really nice fish down the other way. And I didn't see a whole, whole lot of spawning activity. Expecting to see a little bit more today now that we're later into the spawn. March 8th, so pretty much anywhere here in South Texas, they should be spawning. Oh, 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 there's a nice fish. Wow, I don't see a bed or anything over here though. That's why I didn't see the fish until I got right up on top of it bed didn't clue me into anything so I wasn't really looking super hard until this big fish just popped up in my vision right there it's coming right by her right now she's not moving golly of course the wind and clouds are gonna come where I can't see now she might be on a bed that I just couldn't tell was a bed or maybe even spooked her off from up here a little bit I don't know there's a couple of little spots here that look like they could be beds See, these are all the elements you have to deal with when you're bed fishing. It's definitely not as easy as everybody tries to act like it is. Or I say everybody. Some people know how difficult it is to actually catch them on a consistent basis. And big fish too. Not just a bunch of little guys. How to fool the big girls too. I'm going to try to actually bump her a little bit here and try to make her mad. Oop, yep, right there. Oop. Ooh. Golly. She didn't whip around towards it. She actually kicked off a little bit. Now she's sitting kind of right here looking at me. Oh, wow. Is this... That might be a bed right, right in front of her. She's coming in shallower. Right here. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. This is a nice fish. Bait's going to hop right by her. Oop. Golly. I didn't want a bumper that time trying to go right by the fish not right on top of her oh she's circling back around though oh and there's the male yep okay okay now I see two fish that really want to be up in this spot all right well I'm gonna back off give them just a second I'm actually gonna rig up 
a white bait that I can see better and one that worked really well the other day on a bigger fish that I found I'm hoping it'll work again it's exactly what I bought them for these little Jenko booty shaker swim baits right here I'm not throwing them like a traditional swim bait I'm not putting them on any side of any sort of jig head or any sort of belly weighted hook or anything I'm actually just just Texas rigging them just to drop it right in front of them like I do with a regular Texas rig except for with a big big bold uh, profile and white so I can see it better too this big girl should have no problem eating a bait like this this is snack size for her golly I don't know I don't see him at all right now I'm just gonna pitch over here where I first saw the fish hanging out I don't know though it's pretty sunny right now and I don't see either one of them see it might have been a mistake there giving them a rest that female seemed to be getting a little bit fired up towards my bait she was coming back towards it anyway she wasn't just running off and staying far away she was definitely coming back around might have should have just kept trying to fire her up while she was getting a little bit worked up because now I don't see these fish at all wow well, I've been standing here for a few minutes now and I just don't see these fish at all. That is wild. That female seemed like she really wanted to be in this little area for a little bit there. This right over here is where I caught the big one already earlier this year. Right down in this corner. She was spawning right in here by these reeds. Oh, and there's another fish in there right now not her it's a smaller fish probably the male that eventually came up and spawned with her huh. still a pretty decent fish I just know it's not her because she was like a you know, like a four pounder or so this is probably like a two and a half but still a fish I want to catch so I'm gonna try to get him right here so stay in there for me it seems pretty spooky, but I do have to be right on top of them also to even be here. So that may be why he's so standoffish right now. Well, he's coming right back up in there though. He's not too standoffish, I guess. Oh yeah, turning down towards my bait. Oh yeah, all over it. Ooh, saw a side flash up. He didn't eat it. I'm back to throwing that natural crawdad right now too, so I can't see my bait. Just watching the fish movement and feeling for a bite. There he is. Right back on it again. Oop, looked around to it. Oop. Looking at it. Don't think he's right on top of it right now, but he's looking. Golly. Can't see where my bait is, is at at all though. Kind of just relying on him, his movements to give me an idea of where it's at. Yep, you know what? I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna go to a white bait. And I think this guy's plenty big enough to just eat this little Jenko, so I'm gonna try the swim bait on him again. Might end up going to that little trick worm, but I like seeing him eat this swim bait, so I'm gonna try this first. Come on, dude. He's getting excited and whipping around, but he's just not eating it quite yet. Oof. Come on, man. I don't know. Maybe this bait is a little bit too intimidating for him. I'm going to switch over to the little white uh, trick worm here so I'm not intimidating him so much, maybe. Hopefully, this fish will eat this little bait real quick. Alright, come on, dude. He might be a little bit smaller than I originally thought, too. He might be part of the problem. That bait might just be intimidating him. Hopefully this will not. He'll eat it pretty quick here. Come on, right in the middle of the bed. Bumped him a little bit, looked around on it. Come on, go eat it. Ah, I think I did it past him too fast right there. A little bit too fast on that one. Popped it a little too hard. 
There you go. Come back around. Let's go get it. Ah. Oop. Oop. Nipped at it. Oop. Got him. No. Golly. Gee whiz. Well. Finally got him to eat it. Well, I missed that fish and then my GoPro battery died, so I had to switch batteries. So it's been a couple minutes. But I don't think this fish is coming back over here right now. Spent all that time trying to get him to bite. Finally got him to bite, but I like to hold him, man. I hate when I finally get him to bite and get all that out of him and I don't even get to show the camera. Don't get to actually hold the fish myself. That really feels like the full accomplishment, full payoff is hold them in your hand for the camera. Oh, there's a the fish again though. There he is right there. He just showed back up as I was picking out this backlash. Oh, oh, go right over to it. Come on. Oh yeah, I think I'm a little bit too far towards the bank though. No, oh, I don't know, he's right on it again. Oop, oop, nipped at it. Oop, nipped at it again. Come on fish, eat it. He's all over it. Wow. He's all over it, right against the bank here. There's kind of a cloud in the water though from him trying to eat it. I can't see my bait. You just see him, he's still fired up. Lee, he's all fired up. Come on, dude, eat it. Wow. Oop, oop. No, dang it. Dang it, dang it. He ate it and spit it out. Now I'm wrapping my line all around this stuff. Golly. That's why I missed him the first time, though, because I'm not setting the hook as hard as I really want to. It's all this stuff in the way. He's right back in there, though. Right back in the middle of the bed. Kicked off for a second. Turn right back around. Oop, all over it. Oop. Oop, 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 oop. Come on. Picked up just the tail. Wasn't even on the bed yet. Oh, yeah. He's real fired up over it now. Oh, yeah. Come on, dude. All over it. Oops. Got him. Got him, got him, got him, got him. Nice. After all that time, ooh, and then he came off and stuck me in the hand. Wow, wow, wow. don't go down that hole, dude. <laughs> don't go down that hole, dude. Where are you going? <laughs> anyway, he's not even two and a half like I thought. He's just a, about a pound and a half. Real small mouth. Real nice, healthy male like they always are in here. Made me work for it for quite a long time there to finally hold him, but finally got him thank you buddy that was fun man it's so frustrating to know that just right over there on the other side where those fish are hanging out including that one real big one but it's just so windy and overcast that I can't see over there I think I could get the male to bite today but I'm not sure about the female and she's really the one I would want to get Ooh, ooh, ooh. Just scooped the fish right off top of the rocks right here. I was saying earlier how they don't really like these rocks too much, like I thought they would. But I have caught a couple of them bedding on these rocks. And I just saw one kick off right here. From what I believe is a bed on top of this rock. It's hard to tell. Oh yeah, yep. Fish just came right over top of the rock again. So I think that's his spot right there. I'm gonna pitch way past. And walk up real slow. I think he's still over top of that rock. Oh yeah, he's still in there. I'm gonna crawl it right over to him. Can't see my bait, but I'm gonna have to watch his reactions. Oh yeah, he's turning towards me. He's watching it already on top of the rock next to him. Oop. 
she was top up next to him and he went off the rock for a second. Went down into a dark hole though. Actually down to where my bait was at. Can't see him right now. I'm gonna try to crawl my bait just right on top of the rock where I can see it. Well, felt it come on top of the rock, but I can't see it. Golly, that's how dark it is right now. I can't even see my bait right on top of that real shallow rock. Yep, there he is right there. Yep. Ooh. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Picked it up for a second, but I think he spit it out before I set the hook. All right, let's try to get back over here again. There's the rock. Yep, there's the fish. He just went over the top of it. Okay, I'm going to pitch way past it and crawl it up here again. Yeah, he's sitting right on top of the rock right now. Probably going to spook off for just a second. Nope, not really. Looked right at my bait on the other rock. Might eat it over there even. Oop. I don't know, I think it fell down into the crevice again. I'm try to crawl it up on top of his rock. Yep, right there. I can't see it, but I felt it. Crawl right up his rock. It's sitting on top of his rock right now. Oop, yep, and he just nipped it. Oop. Got him. Got him. Nice. <laughs> Very nice. I didn't see him pick it up. I just felt him. And then I saw my line swimming off. Perfect. Perfectly hooked right in the right in the roof of the mouth. Nice. He's got a jacked up jaw from an old injury, I guess. Funny. Funny looking face on that one, but <laughs> another nice, real solid male like they always are in here. Thank you for playing, buddy. That was fun. Right down here is where these big fish, or this one big fish was. I think it's a decent male too, but that female is huge. This is where they were, right down here. female was always hanging off to the left but I don't see her right now I see the male over by the bed the wind is actually laid down a little bit for right now so I can see pretty decently the male is over by the bed but I don't see the female anywhere right now might only get a chance at him today but that's all right Don't know how much he's gonna want to stay up in here with me right on top of him again. I don't know, he's kicking around over to the left like he's maybe maybe getting that female, I don't know. It looked like that's what he was trying to do was wrangle a fish the way he moved out there just now, but I don't see if another fish out there. Anyway, I'm trying to get my bait past his bed here. He spooks way off right there when I cast, just like earlier. I can't see my bait at all, but I'm gonna try to get back up in here. Watch the fish, see if he'll come in with me backed up a little bit. Doing the same thing as earlier, he's sitting way off where my bait's at, just looking at it from behind. Not wanting to come into the bed with my bait out there like that. I can't see him again. Oh yeah, there he is, right in the middle of the bed. Right there. Bait's going right at him. Oop. Oop, he's all over it. Golly, he just rolled up big time next to it. Thought he was about to eat it. Come on, fish. I think he's looking at it. He's looking at something. Oh yeah. Oop, oop, get excited. Come on, pick it up. The tail's moving a whole lot. Oop, he's all over it. Come on, fish. Oop, got him. Stuck him finally. Nice, nice. Finally got that sucker to, to eat. Took, took hours total because I had to come back for him, but <laughs> finally got that sucker to eat. Got that little male. 
There we go. All right. Little male. He's got him a big old girlfriend out there. Big old girlfriend. I'd really like to get her, but like I said, when I came back, I didn't see her anywhere around. But anyway, there's his bed right there next to that orange thing. There's a cleared out spot in the grass all the way down to the roots I can see. Oh, he's got a blind eye too. Wow. This fish has already got one blind eye. Huh. Anyway, took me a while to get him, but I finally got him. Thank you for playing, buddy. Is that the female right there? Oh my gosh. It is. The female is right over here still. Wow. Oh my goodness. Yeah, she's right out there. Wow. Well, I don't know where she went. Been kind of just casting around here, just close to the bed, hoping I'll get her to react, but I haven't seen her even show herself here in quite a while. So it's probably gonna be the last fish I catch right there, unless I see one on the way back. Oh, look, see? Just turn towards my baby. Oh, Oop, yeah. nipped at it. He nipped at it. Oop, got him. Oh, what the heck? No, what the? What? I okay. set the hook and I pulled that up. Oh my gosh. Wait, right, did right. we just pull up the whole bed? That's eggs. Huh? Is eggs. It? Is it eggs? Everywhere. Oh, it is eggs. Throw them back in. Eggs everywhere. Throw them dude. back in. Oh my gosh. 